Okay, I know I was dialing back on the Hololive coverage, but this is breaking news and it's pretty insane. This Reddit post is from just under an hour ago. Here's what it says. Oh, and by the way, big thanks to CGH for the news tag. From Reddit with the title, entire Billy Billy community blasted my videos with hate comments, haha. -ha. Billy Billy now suspends all my videos for censorship. I'm a small Chinese content creator and recently I tried to make two videos only to tell people that Coco didn't do anything wrong and explain to people why they are wrong about Coco and Hato. There was no problem uploading the video four days ago, but if I upload any video including things about Coco or Fubuki right now, it will be taken down immediately, even if the content is not directly mentioning Coco or Fubuki. After the two videos uploaded, the entire comment section of both videos are filled with hate and malicious comments. Some of them say that they support Hololive Moments, as Hololive Moments didn't do anything wrong at all. Coco is just full of political thought, and she is causing a huge problem. Other comments are just saying things like, you're a traitor of China, etc. I want more people to know the facts, but it seems like there's no need for facts at all. He also generously included two screenshots. Now, I can't make out what's being said here, but at least we have evidence that this story is not just completely fabricated. You know, there's agitators, as we've already discussed, so it's good to confirm that these things are authentic. And this does indeed look to me like pretty authentic Billy Billy video comment section, and you get the idea there's the Hall Live Moments community tab post on their video. By the way, is that Hestia behind the image? That's like 50 weeb cred if I get that right, right? Is it 50, 50, 65 maybe? Maybe something like that? Anyways, there's also another image and uh, you, you can see right here. I, I think you all get the idea. So there's not too much else to really be said about this. This man's a brave man though. He went into the hornet's nest, so to speak, jumped right in and actually did this. Now, you know, I gotta be honest though, jokes aside, this is kind of, this is gonna sound a little bit like a joke, but I'm serious. Uh, I'm worried about this guy. Is he allowed to even do this in China? I mean, is he gonna get in trouble? I mean, he's getting in trouble on Billy Billy already, and apparently they're restricting what he can post and upload on there. So I don't know, man. I'm like concerned about this person's well-being IRL now as well. Uh, hopefully this doesn't escalate at all for him. I've also seen people saying that you can't even make an account in China on Billy Billy without providing your actual information, like a driver's license or an ID, this sort of thing. Now, I haven't confirmed that myself. I haven't tested that out. But the really sad thing is that I think the reasonable assumption here is that, yeah, China probably does have that, uh, or Billy Billy probably does have a system like that enacted when you see how China acts with social credit systems and things like that. I think, sadly, again, it's more reasonable to believe that, yeah, that is how Billy Billy works than to just, you know, assume that, no, that's absurd. There's no way they would do that. Man, tough times we're in. Feel bad for the China bros out there that just want to enjoy the show. Speaking of the show, that's all I got for you in this one. Thanks for tuning in as always, and I look forward to catching you next time.